Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the Municipal Garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal Garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck? I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Oh, of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot, but sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh. Right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry? Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Spidey? Spider-Man, over here. No sign of my stuff. <coughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. Help! I can't hit him! Take this! Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey! Mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Please be here, please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Look, is that guy who can see Spider Man? Uh oh. Ice him!
Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over it? Oh, that's too formal. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Ah, oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm, someone left me a voicemail. Numbers blocked, though. Hey there, Spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. Hey, so this gang war between the demons and Fisk is really heating up. I know. Even Shocker's a part of it. Got roped into running jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. Do they just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The black cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. Need to look harder. Got up there. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter. I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. <sighs> Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. Man, was I ever a dork. Well, we all have an awkward face.
So I was into horses. Wasn't everybody at some point? Wish May would take some of this down. It's embarrassing. Miss you. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. Just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after- Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Here you go. Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey doing? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building rezoned for commercial. We had to move into feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Another camera. Gotta be Black Cat. Are you jealous I'm visiting my other man? I hope so. But you should know bad boys aren't my type. Found you. Why are you doing this, Felicia? You know I'm gonna catch you. Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason. Even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Jeff, congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over.
truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched a ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> Consolidated shipping. <sighs> Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. Boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go. their attention. On the outside to look for fist men. Survivors fast.
Hey, big guy. You okay? Fisk, your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic fist talks. That just happened? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. I know. You need to bring it down. I know. Maybe you could superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. I live to regret this. Hi, is this the flight to Newark?
I need to disable the helicopter's engines. One engine down. Now for the second. This is your master plan? Replace Fisk? Fisk is on the way. Kidding! Need a plan. A plan real fast. I guess this is the plan. Come on, Pete. You got this. You got this. You got this. You got this. Don't screw this up! These masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, hey, Solomon! They're cool, thanks! Do they have a website? Uh, yes! Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. Oh, crap. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. And now for listener emails. Made from Queens writes, You're so full of anger and I wish you'd get help managing it. It's terrible for your health. Now I know she speaks from a place of concern, but this is a common misconception that I have to correct. I'm not full of anger. I'm full of love. I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because I adore this city. And I want it to be better. What you hear in my voice is love. Nothing but love. Your car crash. Incident was reported near Trinity. There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. The last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. That, like, I would like, to hand like it over, to over? over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends. Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh... Instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, 
it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with the Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer.
right there. I was right there. Gotta help him. I got you, Dad. to leave now Dad 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 no! Wake up, Dad. Wake up. Wake up. I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry, it's, it's a part of God's plan. I'm sorry, I was just try trying to help. 
I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with him. Sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy! Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey. So, what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up, and that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on Lee? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. Makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Hmm, sounds a little far-fetched. This coming from a guy who can run up walls. Folks, I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Hey, Uncle Ben. Miss you. Doing my best to make you proud. Pigeon target acquired. Come on. It's a fast. Nothing like putting my skills to good use. Hey, Howard. I think I found one of Pidgey's cousins. Dusty Gray Flex. Might have just left a stain on my suit. <laughs> Guy's a little devil, but he's a charmer. Give him a pat on the head and point him towards Feast. He'll find his way. No problem. I'll do the same for any others I find. Another camera. Looks like Black Cat, all right. Oh, poor spider. I know I disappointed you when I couldn't go straight, but why mess with perfection? Another cat. I think they sell rare wine here. She's branching out. Gotta try and get ahead of her. Ha! <laughs> Pigeon! Don't run! I won't hurt you! <laughs> okay! Break-in in progress. Please proceed to... Hey, we're running another piece on Jefferson Davis, and it made me wonder, how's his son Miles doing? Not good. I've been there. The loss is all you can think about. He needs something to do outside of school. Maybe a part-time job? That's not a bad idea, but it has to be the right job. Something that makes him feel useful, like what he's doing matters. Kind of think you just described Feast. MJ, that's perfect. I'll talk to May about it. That's what I'm here for. 
These cameras aren't cheap. If Felicia's really strapped, why is she leaving them lying around? I love making you chase me, Spider. Someday I might even let you catch me. Just not today. Aha. Black Cat does enjoy playing games with people. Especially me. It is my responsibility to catch that pigeon. I can't believe it. Black Cat's been here. She was doing this in person the first time I caught her. Or did she catch me? This can't just be some elaborate flirtation. Hasn't she heard of dating apps? She's up to something. Bam. That's Ty Stone's place. And it's full of priceless art. You're playing with fire, Felicia. But I guess that's how you roll. Friends, I've just received Oops. an update on Adrian Toomes, a.k.a. The Vulture. Apparently, this winged criminal has fallen ill with cancer, and he's been moved to the Raft's infirmary for treatment, which will undoubtedly cost a fortune in public funds. Now, let me ask you, why do we even have an infirmary at the Raft? It's a supermax prison full of maniacs. If they get sick, let nature take its course. Now, I realize that's harsh, but so is my tax bill. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Okay, that's all of them. Security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. Need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. Junction box. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. Uh huh. from Fisk's armory. Truck bombs? This is crazy. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. 
This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. <sighs> be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the Demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly, but also with style. Lee's not out here. Better check inside. from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. Wasn't enough. I don't know what I was expecting, but it was definitely not this. Hey, MJ, I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. No, but I found something we should look into. It's a place called Pale Horse Rise. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. This is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Down! Code SM-1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM-1. Code SM-1. Holding for orders. Copy Code SM-1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverbird. Entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. 
This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International, a private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on this. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Hey. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this, and what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Pigeon alert. Ah, gotta get him. Would you look at that? Half the crime tower's back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to spider cop. His casual disregard for by-the-book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around. Someday. Pigeon alert! Oh, come back, little birdie! Happy to help. You know these little guys pretty well, huh? Getting there. Sandra always knew him best, of course. Sandra? Oh, uh, my, my wife. Well, tell Sandra she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. 